Hello and good morning everybody. I suppose all of you are fit and fine in this lockdown situation. Um, you are not only in lockdown, but I think you are completely locked in. Isn't it? Uh, yeah, students, if I ask you, uh, what are you doing these days? Uh, maybe to satisfy me, all of you will be saying, uh, sir, studying. Um, okay. Let us accept that all of you are studying, but definitely some of you are a little reluctant to study or you are thinking, oh, okay, I'll just manage it later. Yeah, plenty of number of days in hand. And some of you are really seriously studying. But one thing I find uh, there is a problem in common. That many of you are asking, sir, we are not getting energy. Yeah, that's right. Now the question is, where will you get the energy from? If you stand in the sunlight, will you get energy? Or if you take multivitamin tablets, will you get energy? One thing you are missing, my dears. Uh, what you need is actually, you need uh, proper uh, nutrition, optimum rest, and of course, physical exercise. Uh, your parents are taking care, um, taking care of your uh, nutrition, of course. And you are enough to provide yourself optimum rest or beyond optimum rest. But what about the physical exercise? Yeah, this is the area where maximum people, most of the people compromise. You also do so, I think. Uh, the reason is you do not know the importance of it. Actually, it doesn't have immediate effect, like uh, allopathy drugs or something like that. That's why people neglect it. And that's why people knowingly or unknowingly compromise in their, with their health. But today I am here uh, to show you a few exercises that you can do at home. Mm -hmm. Even if you have a very little uh, space, these exercises are very Absolutely uh, free hand exercises. Okay, so um, let us uh, start those exercises. Uh, it will take very little time. Um, before that, I'd like to tell you, I, I do not know whether you are uh, able to perform it now right in front of me or not. But even if you see this video and afterwards you can do these exercises, just pair 12 minutes a day at the rate of 30 seconds per hour. If you spare half a minute per hour, you will be sparing 12 minutes a day. I think any one of you, anybody can spare this time for your physical exercise for your own health. So let us start the exercise. First of all, what will you do? You will be doing a little jogging first of all. Okay. So let's start how to do the jogging. First of all, do the jogging on the on your spot, the stationary jogging, stationary running. Okay. You are doing the stationary running okay do it for one minute if possible two minutes after this what will you do you will do this exercise uh, perhaps you have uh, already learned this exercise that uh, jumping jack jumping jack is in um, the four counts or eight counts just i'm saying you in four counts first of all you have to jump keep your feet apart arms at your shoulder line i think you can see me arms at your shoulder line palm facing downward this is one. Now back to the initial position two. Now take your left foot forward and both the arms forward. Again the same position, palm facing downward, arms at your shoulder height. This is three and four. So once again, one, two, three, four. Similarly, other four will be done by right foot. Five, six, seven, eight. If you are a little bit habituated, then you can do it with a little a faster pace. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, this is called jumping jack. Uh, next, we are coming to that scissor steps. Keep your hands at your waist, palm facing downward. Just like the scissors, two blades of the scissor. Your both the feet will move forward and backward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You can do it fifty times. One, 
two, three, four, five. Like this, you can do it fifty times. These are these are the exercises <coughs> to give you a little first respiration. Uh, this will help you to warm up. Next, you are coming to some uh, stationary exercise like arm exercise. Okay, first of all, side one, one, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8. Next one, it will be upward and downward. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Now you can combine both these exercises. Like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Once again, 1, 2, 3, up to this, like the first exercise. Now, four hands up. Five, six, seven, eight. Once again, just see it. Uh, I'm doing a little first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Now, after this exercise, you'll be doing a little squat exercise. Squat means you have to sit. Either you may sit half or you may sit full. Before sitting, your position should be like this. Both your feet should be at your hip width. Don't keep them too far from each other. Keep them apart, of course. But the, the, the distance between the feet will be around 6 to 8 inches. For you, it can be a little less also. Keep your arms at your shoulder height. Palm facing downward. Just sit half. One. See, the thighs are parallel to the ground. Two, three, four. So, in once, when you sit once, you just count one. And do it 10 to 15 times, like one, two, three, four. This is half squat, okay? Now, full squat will be definitely full. You will have to sit fully. Again, the same position. Keep your arms at your shoulder height, palm facing downward. One, two. Sorry, this is only one. Second, three, four. Like this, you'll be doing 10 to 15 times according to your own capacity, of course. So, these are the squats. Uh, next to this, let us come to some stretching exercises. How to stretch? First of all, arm stretching. Arm stretching. Okay, you are stretching your arms. Actually, we are saying arm stretching, but actually you are stretching your this pex muscle. Chest muscle, this is called pectoralis major. So this pex muscle is stretched. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. After this stretching, let us come to the neck. See, gradually you are going um, further from the heart. This one is closer to that. After that, little far, there is a neck. We are going to the neck region. Down, straight, up, front, down, front. Now left, keep it for a while. Front, right, front, left, front, right, front. Okay? Don't give any jerk like this. Okay? You will, you will get a catch. And please, uh, one exercise I am telling you, since you are doing the neck exercise, one exercise you will, will never do. This rotation like this will never do. I will tell you later uh, why you should not do this exercise. This neck rotation is a very dangerous exercise. Now you may not feel, but afterwards that will definitely give you some problem. Anyway, let us come to next stretching. Keep your arms like this behind your head at the neck. Now side stretch. Small jerk. Very small jerk. Very little. One, two, three. One, two, three. Like this. Five times this side, five times that side. Now front and back. Similarly, keep your Palms behind your 
head and lean forward as much as you can and then bend backward. While bending backward, if you think you are a little disbalanced, you can keep your arms here behind the hip at your waistline. Now forward and backward. When you are bending backward, this part is stretched. When you are bending forward, back muscle is stretched as well as your hamstring, this muscle is stretched. Okay, after this exercise, uh, next is toe touch. If you touch your toe, bend forward and touch your toe with a very little jerk, your hamstring will be stretched. Very little jerk to those who are fit enough. If you think, you can easily catch it and touch your knee by your forehead. Okay, but don't do at a uh, sudden stretch. Um, next, cup muscle. This muscle is called cup muscle. Cup muscle, you can keep your hand straight up and lift your body up. Stand on your toes as high as you can. Keep your heels above the floor. The heels will not touch the ground. Now gradually pull them down. Take them down. But you will not stand on your heels. Take this for few seconds and slowly again come up. Your cup muscle will be stretched. Do it four to five times. After that, relax. Now, after this stretching exercise, what you have to do is you have to do a little strengthening exercise. Like you have already done the stretching exercise of your arms. Now, strengthening exercise. This is called push up. How to do the push up? Many of you know this exercise as dips. Whatever you say, take your position like this. The gap between two hands is just like a chest. The chest width like this. I hope all of you I can, I can cover me. Yeah. Like this. One, two, three, four, five. Girls. Uh, don't try to do this and boys those who think that is a little tough try to avoid But in place of that what will you do? Keep your arms little above the floor like this and just facing backward that side you can easily see me Take your hands like this And then push up one two three four this pattern is the must for the girls and um, some boys also you can do if you think that on the floor it will be a little tough for you. Gradually you will go to the floor of course after a few days. Next strengthening exercise is your triceps dips. Keep your palms here either on the cushion or on the solid wood also. Keep your legs a little forward and dips. Take your hip down, touch the floor by your buttock and get up. This will strengthen your triceps. Those who have the problem, you are saying, I am not getting energy. I guarantee you, you will be full of energy. Provided you get enough rest, optimum rest, I want to mean. And of course, proper nutrition. Drink plenty of water because summer is already approached, isn't it? You're feeling very hot now. I am almost under the fan. Anyway, next one is another strengthening exercise that is for the legs. Because you have already stretched the legs muscles, now it needs some strengthening exercise. Very simple, what you can do at home is just squat jump. Okay, squat jump. That, that will strengthen your entire leg muscle. Okay, this, this many are uh, more than enough for you. After doing all these things, um, you can lie down on the floor for two minutes to take a rest. Just relax. This entire session, I don't think it will cross 12 minutes to 15 minutes. Since I was explaining while doing the exercise, it was taking, I think it has taken 15 minutes or so. 
But if you do these exercises one after other, this exercise will not take more than 12 minutes. After performing these exercises, if you think that this 12 minutes are very little for you, you can stretch it. You give 1 minute per hour, that means 24 minutes every day. 24 minutes every day, it's uh, just nothing, my dear. Because whole day is left. You are not giving even half an hour. 24 minutes, even 6 minutes left to cover half an hour. And those who think that yes, you can uh, do a little more, you can improvise some of the exercises as you are uh, doing this exercise, arm exercise. If you think, since you are not carrying anything, uh, you prefer to carry some loads, dumbbell or something, I will suggest you carry two water bottles. Don't fill them completely. Take half, half filled water, half liter, half liter, and then do this exercise. Okay, if you think that is also very easy to do, make it full. Okay, that's all. Uh, we'll see you again in the next video. Till then, bye-bye.